Hi, I'm Matt from Outspoken Bicycle and Sport, and I'm here today to explain to you um, binding angles on your snowboard. And uh, basically, what a binding angle is, is how the binding actually sits on the snowboard. You know, you can have it in, out, you know, it's different preferences. And the way to determine the angle of your binding, you have a disc that actually sits in this hole right here. And there's different angles indicated on that disc. And there's a, there's a, a center line of the binding, which determines, will tell you what your angle is on that binding. And the reason for different angles is riding styles. So if you're a rider that generally rides more all mountain, um, faster, harder turns, carving, such like that, you're gonna have an angle that is a little more aggressive towards the front of the board. So whichever foot you are forward, you're gonna have a little bit more aggressive of an angle, um, front and back, going the same direction. Um, that's for people that go one direction, um, and you know, don't go in the snowboard park or um, hit jumps or anything like that. They just go one direction, they like to turn a lot, and they like to go fast. That's generally the reason that you have that type of angle. Um, the other angle is, we will. Um, this is for people that are beginning to snowboard. What we'll do is we'll put their angle a little bit more on the front binding and a little bit less on the, uh, on the back binding. So we'll have, say, a 15 degree angle in the front binding and a zero in the back. And what that does is it helps the person more simulate their natural stance when they're standing. And uh, so it's a lot easier for them, a lot more comfortable to get used to going down the hill on a snowboard. And next is um, basically a snowboard park or a free ride all mountain guy that likes to hit jumps, do rails, um, you know, jump off things on the side of the trail, um, rides fakie or switch. Um, and basically what we do there is you'd have a positive angle in the front, um, which is say a 15, which is an average angle for us guy that rides in the snowboard park. And in your back foot, you'd have a negative angle of such, say such 15. And what the stance is called is actually called a duck stance. And what that does is um, for snowboards that are uh, a twin tip snowboard, park oriented snowboard, that helps the person be able to go regular stance or go switch or fakie as they call it. And um, that just is, helps them do different tricks, land, switch or fakie, um, you know, such like that. And um, different bindings will have different base plates. Some will have a cover over the base plate to keep, you know, snow out and stuff like that, which, uh, um, but this binding in particular just has a hole in the middle with your disc that goes in it and four bolts that hold it to the snowboard. And uh, that's how to set up a snowboard with uh, angles.